Hey everyone, it's Coach Dave here. We've got a small little update coming for Delta just before uh, the festive season begins. Um, our team's going on a small break, so we launched a couple little quality of life updates and some bug fixes that I just wanted to quickly take you through. So now in Delta, we've got a couple of things that uh, have just added a little bit of detail and also improved on the interface based on some of your feedback. Um, so far, it's been amazing. It's been seven days, just over seven days since we launched Delta. And we've already recorded over 250,000 laps in the app, which is mental. So what are the changes in the record interface? A couple of things. We did a lot of cleaning up on the friends leaderboard, which you'll see as you log in, especially on the ACC side, because SimGrid is powering these leaderboards and there's a lot of ACC lap times uh, on SimGrid, obviously. So the leaderboard will be richer now. You can also now follow your friends more easily on SimGrid.com. On the right-hand side, we've added a session duration or stint more accurately, a stint duration. So for each stint, you'll be able to see um, the duration um, that that stint took. This is really useful in the endurance races and so on. Um, the oversteer understeer widget, the, the handling widget has been tweaked to sort of exaggerate and, and move a little bit more compared to the initial release. We found that the initial release, the bars were a little bit too tight. So we just had to play a little bit with those ratios to get a more accurate reading um, of what you should be experiencing or will be feeling rather um, below 120 and over 120. This widget still needs some more refinement, but we're happy where it is for now. And um, we're actually quite keen to get your feedback on that one. Another new widget that we've added is VMAX. So this is your top speed in that stint. This will be useful when you're testing for Monza and Paul Ricard Spa, and you're still trying to des decide which car. The VMAX is now going to be a useful little tool that you can uh, use for those comparisons. In the sidebar, I wanted to run you through a couple of tweaks we've made there. We've moved the fuel estimated to the top of the sidebar. Um, as we feel that that's more relevant throughout the stint, um, you're going to be playing with that a lot more. And the setup list has moved down to the bottom of the sidebar. So with, with this change, we've also tried to simplify what you see in the accordion names. Otherwise, it just tended to be a bit of a waterfall of setups, if you will. And uh, you'll see that the file name of the setup is still inside the accordion but we've pulled a little bit of that information out to make it easier to read. So now you'll see the car setup conditions. Uh, we've pulled that into three blocks, dry setup, uh, 28 to AA32 track, and that will update as the session updates as well. Don't forget, as the session changes in temperature, we update the setups with new tire pressures, tire pressure presets for you to, to use throughout the stint. Right, last but not least is on the home page. We made a much request change for iRacers. So if you're watching this as an iRacer, take a look here. We now show you which content, setup content, has been uploaded so that you can more easily determine what cars you, you want to drive on that any given day. Now uh, on the homepage, I'll just go through that again. On the homepage, in the right sidebar, there's a view season catalog for iRacing. Click on that. It will bring up a bunch of accordions. And if you click on any of these accordions, you'll see the setups that are available for the cars and the tracks in that particular series. Much easier to help you determine what you're gonna be wanting to drive. So there you have it. That's our sort of end of year quality of life updates, small feature tweaks for Delta. Next year we've got much more planned. Thank you to everybody who's been using it so far. The reception has been far beyond our expectations. All right, that's it. Until the next one, catch you around the next lap. Peace.